I'm anxious to go over there. I think it's going to be a real interesting excursion into an exotic world. I'm hoping that they're just going to appreciate the uh, the Raku firing. That's that's initially that's what I was uh, invited over to do was to uh, put together a kill and a body of work and to uh, fire it. I guess I'm hoping that that uh, you know the uh, the language barrier won't be a problem. I just got in last night, so I'm, yeah. I'm still jet lagging and trying to get my uh, uh, my feet on the ground here. One bench and two more of these. Two more, yes. And one bucket, bucket. Uh, container, bowl, like basin. Basin. There we go. <laughs> Very soft clay. It scrapes rather than compresses. I may have to just adjust the way that I work. This is much nicer to throw. Uh, yeah, this is the mix. I, I uh, wedged in some of the very coarse clay that I was trying earlier with some of this very fine clay, and it, it seems to be working much better. And uh, we'll see how it comes through the firing. That's going to be the test, whether it will stand the shock of uh, Raku. Uh, I can't remember if we go here or in through the building. So so he, he turned it off and then turned yeah, it back on again? Right. So how many how what temperature when he turned it off? Uh, and how many hours to do that? Half an hour. Half hour? Yes. One half hour? No, just half an hour. One half hour? No, just 30 minutes. I think it'll fire fine. We'll find out on uh, the 21st, two days from now. Trying to get this show on the road here be in the center stage it's uh it's weird it's odd uh, salsa Beautiful. Let's give him a big hand.